this year's aliexpress dropshipping tutorial hello guys and welcome to this new tutorial in today's video i am going to show you how you can set up the this year's platform and how we can import some products and all the products from aliexpress to the platform so it is very easy and very simple all you need to do is to follow up the tutorial from the beginning till the end and you are going to be good to go the first thing that you need to do is to have an account within the platform of Deezers. So it is very easy. Either you are going to set up here an account manually with an email address and also a password, verify your steps, or you can go ahead and have a Shopify account. So you can go ahead and drop ship within the platform of the Shopify since it is going to be here uh, creating for your uh, store. Uh, so you can go ahead and easily drop ship or send uh, here your products and sell them so this series is a dependent platform with the stores so it is not going to create for you a store but you need a third-party app or a platform like shopify wix or any of these platforms to set up the app also go ahead and set up the uh, products so how this series is going to work with AliExpress? It is very simple. So you are going to head over the DSERS dashboard and when you are going to click on uh, find products, you're going to see the first thing that you have here, the partner, which is going to show up and it is AliExpress. So here we have the platform of AliExpress. If you want to add another platform, you're going to see only that we have AliExpress installed. So basically we have a collaboration between the two platforms. And also we do not have to forget that we have an extension. So you're going to head over the home and then you're going to see here we have a Chrome extension that also could be transferred or extended to the Microsoft Edge Navigator. So you are going to install this application or this extension and then you are going to see it right there. So you're going simply to get this DSERS uh, integration so you can import directly from your AliExpress right there. I'm going to visit here AliExpress uh, page so you can go ahead and see that we can work with these. So for the shippings, we are going to set all euro right there. You are going to set everything. So I have set up the, uh, as you can see, the settings. So this specific, as you can see here, um, uh, integration or uh, installed tool is going to help you import the product directly from AliExpress. So you can go ahead and choose one of the products that are available here. For example, this one, I'm going to choose this product. And from here, I'm going to choose one of the products that are available here. It's my product that is going to be here like that set. Now uh, let's choose any of these products. So we need only a, a correct URL. So we are going to set up here the data and normally you are going to see that it uh, right there going to be here important as the data from AliExpress, obviously to your DSERS account. So let's here talk about the finding products on the DSERS. So as you can see, we have the AliExpress uh, logo. You can go ahead and select or search for any type of uh, products from AliExpress, obviously, and uh, then you're going to start drop shipping them. So, for example, here we have this uh, fiber socks, breathable, compression, long sleeve, business casual, middle large. That doesn't matter for the title. I don't need that. So I can go ahead and select one of the products from these years. Here you're going to get the same products on a Shopify, not on Shopify, but on AliExpress. As you can see, they are tagged. Here we have the AliExpress quality control. So you are going to make sure that these products are sold on the AliExpress. And for the prices are going to be here set up. So how we can choose a product, you can either right there go uh, here to the entry keyword to search and search for a specific product, for example, power bank i'm going to type in here power and see if we can go ahead and get a result with that and normally power bank i need to be more specific i think 
Also, we have the feature to uh, get a photo or import a photo and get some results within that specific one. So here, as you can see, we have some, uh, I think that the power banks are not available within that, but we have some special portable power banks that are going to be here uh, charged within uh, different methods. So it doesn't matter right there for the product. You can go ahead and get the extension and get it from Aliexpress. And here I'm going to ignore that. So we are going to get the first uh, section from here. We're going to select one of the products like this one. I'm going to see it on Aliexpress directly. So we're going right there to add it to the import list. So click on it. This is a sign that we can go ahead and see that product. I'm going to click on stay. So we're going to see the product that we have chosen to import, which we have clicked on the hamburger menu right there on the import list. So we are going to see it here. And from there, we are going simply to see all the products that has been uh, right there on the import list. I'm going to delete the products that I don't need. And this, I'm going to tag it. And as you can see, we have our Shopify store. So how you can do to install the integration of the DSERS onto your Shopify store, you are going to open up a store on Shopify. This is very obvious. Then we are going to type in on the search bar at the top, DSERS, and it will take you right there on the Shopify app store. You are going to see the official logo of the app. You need to install it. And this is a very mandatory process. So this is it. You're going to see it here. Click on install instead of open right there. And then we are going to get the integration installed. Now back to the DSERS, we are going to click on push to store. And then you are going to select your store. After that, you have here some preferences. Go ahead and check or uncheck whatever you want. And from here, you can go ahead and see that the prices are here. So if you want to modify them, we are going simply to push it to the store. And then we are going to get it right there. So we are going to see if we need some modification about that product. And here we are going to import the reviews if you want, but it is going to install here another app, which is Luke's. I think that we don't need that for the moment. I'm going to head over my Shopify products and see if it is added. And obviously it is, as you can see, we have it. Now we have the, uh, the product, as you can see, we have the photos, we have uh, the color or the variants. We have the price, which is going to be here set up for something like this. I'm going to click on save and this is published. Now I am going simply right there to view that product into our the Shopify store. And this is how we can drop ship any product from D series that is going to be here collaborating with Shopify and also AliExpress. So this is a very good or a very cool collaboration, also integration. So you need to do that to start your drop shipping journey. I'm going to click on this exit that and here we have the product do not forget to verify your product and also the quantity that has been pushed to your store so you are going to see here the availability the locations also the uh, number of the product so we have only 34 so it will right there close the product or set it as sold out whenever they have finished this quantity so you are going either right there to contact the seller on Shopify, or you are going simply right there to have a, and get a similar product from D series. So you can go ahead and do that with all you want. So for example, let's go ahead and add another product. It will be the same process. So for example, we are going to add another product, which is going to be maybe this one. So it will let you see it on Aliexpress. Obviously, we're going to click on the import list. Here we have it. I'm going to click uh, this time on check. So we have it here. I'm going to check it, push to store. Then we are going to see it here. Click on push to store. Here we have 
beer related products so you are not going to get out of the or run out of the stock of the product don't worry you can go ahead and add whatever you want from there just click on the button and boom here we have it you're going to head over the products again boom i think it is going to be here yes it is here the Velva soft cure cover so here it is going to be here uh, uh setting up the images that we need obviously also the media and here we have the images or the variant also each one of the images of them and the availability of them so that was all for today's video thank you guys for watching i hope that you have enjoyed the content and I hope to see you soon on the next one